Hey everyone, Dan here, and welcome back to The Sims 4, where, oh no, Genesis has arrived. This is, why does she always, do she always arrives, like, just out of nowhere, like, really randomly. I'm sorry, Genesis, Dan's busy. He's busy cleaning the side, because um, at the end of last episode, we had, um, we had a fire, which was uh, a bit unfortunate. Um, oh, he needs to go to the toilet. Um, I'm sorry, Dan, you need to go to the toilet. Um, you need to do that right now, actually. Um, oh god, he can't. Uh, I can see why. Hurry up and get out the shower. There we go. Beautiful. So, she's gonna use the toilet, and today we still need to get a bun in the oven for Traorus. Um, that still needs to happen. Has he got work today? He does, but he starts work at 12, which is good, and she still doesn't have a job, which is awesome. Um, Genesis, go away! I mean, we don't need you right now. I'm really sorry. I just don't want you right now. I'm really sorry. Um, what do people need? So, Treos needs almost everything. Um, he better... Because Dan's going to work. Um, someone needs to cook. What's her cooking skill like? We've got... Um, cooking is just level 1. Um, Treos is almost level 3. So, if we get him to serve breakfast... Um, why do they always have eggs? <laughs> All they have is eggs. I want to, um, cook. Let's see what else we can have. We can't really have too much else. I guess we should go for a BLT. Let's do four, four of those sandwiches right now. Um, Dan is... No, don't scare her. You need to go to work in a moment. Jeez, what's wrong with you? Why do you want to scare her so badly? No, he done it. <laughs> that was terrible. Why would you do that? Oh, she enjoyed it. It's okay. It's okay. It came across all right. Um, what's this? You don't want... No, move this. Move this. Charles is moaning. Why are you moaning? Joris, Joris, where are you going? What are you doing? Why are you taking those? Why are you taking those over there? Spino? Oh, you need to go yeah, to the toilet. Go. Just, just go. Just go, son. You, it's okay. Use that and then, and then finish off your BLTs because some of us are hungry up in here. What is this actually? Let's put that back in there. She needs to do nothing right now. So you guys, I got you to decide. Um, where did she get that food from? Joris, oh my god. Oh my god, it's gone all messy. Um, so, I got you guys in the last episode to decide what career she should do. And by far, like, by a long, long way, the one that was chosen was Secret Agent. So, we're going to do that because because we can. But first, we need to get her pregnant because there's no point starting a job and then getting her pregnant. And then she does not work. So, um, let's... Actually, I think, I think maybe they still work while they're pregnant. Possibly, so let's just get her to join a career, shall we? So she's gonna do that afterwards, and what is Trails doing? Is he gonna finish that sandwich? He should do. If not, it's gonna be very rude of him. Um, she's full, so that can go in there, I guess. Like a half-eaten meal can go in there. So, secret agent, here we go. Life, um, live for life unnoticed as a covert operative from infiltrating enemy headquarters to the art of interrogation. The more you learn, the less you'll be known. A career branches, diamond agent and villain. Oh, that's cool. We can have another choice for that as well. And the working hours are pretty cool. So, there we go. Bristol is now an agency clerk at Suit and Sunglass. She starts Wednesday at 7. Beautiful. What does she need to do for this? She needs to browse intelligent database on a computer. And um, browse intelligence is a daily, a daily task. So um, actually, while they're doing this, um, I need to try and get her pregnant. So stop making the BLT for now. And see if this could happen. Come on, Charles. Do your work. Do your work and do it well. Let's see if it happens. Let's just speed it up because there are multiple times already. Oh my goodness! Do you do you need to keep coming to the door, Genesis? Like really? Do you need to come in? Stop peeping through the window. It's it's creepy. What is wrong with you? Why are you doing this? Why? Okay, Charles is going to work. He's gonna be okay. He's late. Um, I think he's late. Yeah, he's late. Is that what he's yellow for? Yeah. She's gonna take a pregnancy test. Come on. Third time lucky. Third time lucky. Third time lucky. Doctor is off to work. We know this. Don't don't tease me. Here we go. Here we go. Is it gonna work? Um, yes. Oh my god, eating for two. So cool. Congratulations. Bristol is expecting. There's going to be a new addition to the household. Oh, she's like pregnant straight away. Oh geez. Um, okay. It's gonna happen. Charles is going to be a dad. I think she should resume making this and then um. Just put it away because she's not gonna. She does. She's not hungry, to be honest. Um, and then what? No. What are you doing? I just told you to. Oh wait, did I tell Trios to do that? I don't know. Resume making this, please. 
Bristol is not skilled enough. Oh my goodness, what do you even do? What do you even do? Can we put this in here? No, um, I'm just gonna put that there for now. It looks like a kind of like a wooden laptop, which is a little bit weird. What you need, do need to do though is, oh, we need to pay the bills. Oh, I forgot about that. Oh, what happens if we don't though? I need to browse intelligence, right? Do this, do that for your job. Then we can get that sorted. We need a lot more money. Um, when um, one of them comes home from work, we'll be able to pay that off a little bit. So let's fast forward time. And I'm gonna skip back to after she's done this. Let's see if it's um, working. Um, yeah, it should be working. There we go, 25% done. And we'll come back when some people come back from work and we can pay our bills and not get in trouble. That'd be good. Okay, so she's an active sim, so I guess we could go and get her to go to the gym. I mean, she's pregnant, but hey, we need to get her to go to the gym, keep in shape, cool stuff like that. And she's just an active sim anyway, so let's get her to go to the gym and do a few kind of push-ups, a little bit of the weight training, maybe even like um, some jogging, stuff like that to keep it in shape and make this baby as healthy as possible. Now, I'm really excited to see what this baby looks like, so I might try and get it to be born in this episode so there might be a few like jump cuts every now and then but um that's cool with us that's cool with us oh she could do some boxing um all the boxing things are taken up so what's not taken everything's taken <laughs> everything is there anything up here no there's a there's a bar up here i mean you could take full advantage of that looks like she's gonna do some weights because that's the only machine that's free right now here we go pregnant woman is um pulling weights right now i guess she's got two people to kind of help she's got like a baby to help her out i'm just gonna wait for dan to come home from work and we'll get a nice little notification for that which should be cool go on you can do it you can do it you can do it and then we should get a boost in funds and be able to pay off our bills replace a counter and still be pretty poor <laughs> unfortunately now i think dan might be able to get a promotion which is pretty cool i'm not sure about treyos because he's already had one and her job performance is going to be pretty good as well. Her task is complete. We've got um, that task complete as well. Um, you can't get a promotion on the first day, but um, she, she's on her way there, which is good. Right then, she's done. Are you done? Are you done? And um, what's she going? Oh, she's going. Yep, yeah, she's going to punch the punching bag. Let's do this. Don't be sick, please. Please don't. Not not in a public area. Right, the punching bags are free. Let's see what she does. See what kind of guns she's got. Here we go. She's going for it. There we go. Beautiful. Don't get in the way of a pregnant lady, guys. She will absolutely smack you with her boxing gloves. Awesome. Oh, did you see that evil stare as well? That was pretty creepy. She's going for it. Oh, my God. Dan got a promotion. Quality assurance. Dan has been promoted to quality assurance. He now makes an additional $7 an hour and a grand total of $38 an hour, which is pretty cool. He also received the following bonus. He got a 30, no, 375 simoleon bonus. Bristol has now reached level 2 of fitness. Look at them guns. Oh, man, those guns. And um, he also gained a stainless steel auto pot. Very, very cool. So I'm going to make... I think I might make her go home for now because she's been busy. Oh, no. Our power will get shut off if we don't pay our bills within 24 hours. Oh, dear. We're going to be able to do that now because Dan got a promotion. Absolutely beautiful. So we got a promotion, which means we get normal monies. But we also get a nice little bonus. Which is perfect. So let's um, let's meet back at the house. Well then, we are home. Good job, Dan TDM. You're absolutely the best. Um, can you, um, yeah, replace this and pay bills? I can't remember how to do that. Um, oh, we can do it online. Awesome. We can do it from our phone. So pay the bills, which would be sweet. And resume this BLT for me, please, buddy. Um, what do you do now? So he needs to. Um, use a computer, reach level 2 programming still, and, oh, practice programming. That's something he hasn't done, so he can do that now. After he's completed, um, the meal that Treyora started. And I guess we should kind of go through, um, a few days after this. Just kind of normal days, so that she can just chill out and watch a channel. Let's watch... Oh, cooking shows for ideas. That's pretty cool. That option wasn't available earlier, which is going to be handy. Um, oh, is she hungry? Did he finish it? Wait, wait, wait. Stop, stop. Stop yourself. Um, you can eat one of these. Grab a serving and then I can put it away. So grab one. Go and eat it and watch the cooking channel as well. So watch the cooking show for ideas. Okay, so Dan has acquired the programming skill. He can now hack and practice programming. The higher the level of the skill, the more hacking opportunities will emerge. Nice. So if we get him going on that, he can start to get more of a promotion. He's very sleepy. I mean, it is kind of... Um, it's 8 p.m., it's not too late, Dan. Come on, grow, grow a pair. Come on, we don't need to do that. 
But I've reached level two of programming skill. He just needs to go up this next green bar, which should be okay. Charles should be home any second now. We should get a nice new boost in funds. I'm not sure what else we should buy now. Um, come on, Charles. There we go. <gasps> Promotions all over the place. Oh my goodness, let's pause it a second. Um, Churros has been promoted to a technician. He will now make an additional $20 an hour. Grand total of 54. He got a bonus of $756. Astro model rocket and a point out constellations interaction. Sweet. So he now works 1 p.m. to 9 p.m. Only four days a week. That's pretty good. That's really good, actually. So... Let's see what these guys got in their personal inventories. Actually, they might be in the family inventory. So let's have a quick check of those, shall we? We got an Astro Model Rocket. Have a blast with a super stellar miniature. Let's put that in his room. I mean, he's deserved it. He deserved this. Is there anywhere we can put it? Can we put it on here? Nice, nice, nice. And um, Dan also got the Stainless Steel Auto Pot, which um, is pretty much a coffee machine. So sleek and smooth, impeccably crafted. Heat regulating coffee pot is enough processing power to put a high-end computer to shame. So, unlocked at level 3 or level 2. It's cool that you can kind of unlock items rather than just buy them all from the start. I think that's cool. So, let's put this here. Very nice. Very nice. I'm not sure what we can really buy now. I, I just don't know. We've got a lot of monies now, which is cool. We could kind of expand, but I guess we don't really want to just yet. And Churros is feeling, oh, very unhygienic. Go, um, go for a shower. Um, where are you going? You've just gone to flush it. Um, oh dear, this is going to be awkward. But it should be okay because they're kind of comfortable with, it, with each other. Um, we can just get her to do a clean up for a little bit. And I think I might leave it until the next day. And then we'll get going on seeing how far through her trimester she is. I think it gives you like a little notification. There we go. Pregnant. Second trimester in 15 hours. So I'll come back when she's got a second trimester. And we'll see what happens. See you in a sec. Right then, guys, so I am back, and a couple of people are at wor work, even Treyos went to work at one and got sent home by half two because his performance was so poor. Um, I don't know what's going on with him right there. <laughs> uh, I think he needs a coffee. So I started using the new machine, and this actually gives off a emotional aura. Now, if you don't know what that is, in The Sims 4, emotions are a, quite a big thing of the game, and you can see that Treyos is just plainly fine right now. And all the emotions have been changing throughout this series so far. But there's some items that can give off emotional auras. For example, this one and also this one as well. Which can um, allow you to be more flirty when you're around that item. And this one, I'm not sure what it is. It might be um, it might be energized, possibly. So um, let's grab a drink, Charles. Because you made one before you went to work. But um, now it's just not working, is it? So let's have a look. Okay, so Bristol is home as well, which is awesome. Um, how pregnant she is. She's pretty pregnant right now. Third trimester in 22 hours. So I think we'll get the baby born in this episode, which is actually quite cool. Which means... Oh, God, it's Genesis. Uh, why is she always here? It, oh, she's getting followed by a creepy man. Who is she annoyed now? Look at that. That man is really creeping up on her. Oh, no, this is creepy. I can't watch. I can't watch. Oh, so Bristol is on the coffee as well. I'm pretty sure coffee's not too great for for a baby. But hey, hey, that's what they want to do. So, um, yeah, they can have a casual conversation. I'm really not sure what to buy. So I guess a baby's room would be cool. But it'd be good to know what gender it is. I need a baby name. That's going to be pressure. Hopefully they have like a randomizer button. But um, I think I've got an idea of what I want to call it if it's a boy. If it's a girl, I have no idea. So hopefully that's a randomized option. That's usually pretty handy on The Sims 3. But we need to wait for Dan to come home from work. Luckily, Treyos got sent home. It means he only got paid like $80 or something, which is bad, Treyos. Bad. So, um, yeah, I guess we're going to wait for Dan to get home. And fast forward to when the next trimester happens. Look how happy they are. They look so cool together. Um, I guess we could send them both to the gym so they can work out a little bit. Because Treyos' extra little thing on his job is to work out more. Um, I think. Anyway, let's just quickly check. So, yeah, performance, workout, daily task not started. But I guess he needs to do that in the day. He needs to have four friends as well, which is a little bit difficult. Yeah, it's energized. I thought it was energized. Awesome. So this would be actually a good time for them to both go to the gym. Um, did you... Oh, and also, um, some of the money has gone because I had to repair the toilet because someone broke it. And then straight after that, they broke the sink. Then they went to clean something up. Then they broke the other sink. So I had to replace those, which was pretty important, I guess. And um, he wants to do sit-ups. So exercise. Do some sit-ups, bro. Go on. Do them. Do them and do them well. Check it out. Let's see what Treos does sit-ups like. It's going to be pretty funny. Um, can we move this around? Yeah, we can. Sweet. There he goes. There he goes, in his work outfit. Do the sit-ups. 
Oh, yeah, he's getting energized right now. <laughs> Bristol's just waving at him. This is like, bye, I'm going to go and play on the PC and be really unhealthy. But hey, that's fine. That's fine with us. He wants to clean something. What can we clean? Is there anything that needs cleaning? Clean with vigor. Go on, clean it. Clean it. What is she doing, by the way? She is browsing the web. That's fine. What's her daily task? Um, browse intelligence. She doesn't really need to do that right now because her work's like the next day. I really wish you could check when people would get home from work. He's feeling pretty tense, so I guess he can take it easy. Um, take it easy. There we go. Sweet. Well then guys, it's all go. So I have pretty much done about a day and a half of stuff. It wasn't really too interesting. Gained a couple of skills. Dan TDM is now pretty good at programming. He can now hack and mod games, which is pretty cool. He can mod like The Sims Forever, which would be really, really cool. He also can make plugins. And I'm pretty sure he'll get a promotion today. He's in a good mood. He's got good skills. He's completed all his tasks. And speaking of prom promotion, um, that no, the plug went away I, I wanted i wanted that i wanted to see the notification but she has now been promoted as well which is awesome she is now let's check in here she's now an intelligence researcher she's got a good programming skill which is all right her performance is all right as well and her daily task is to browse intelligence so she is actually now as well in her third trimester so sim is nearly full term more than ready to have this kid and be done with it already give birth in question mark <gasps> When is it going to happen? So let's focus on her for a little bit. Let's give her a nice... Let's give her a steamy show. I mean, why not? And um, that's good. So we got an extra boost in funds as well. We got 2,000. So enough to... Um, it's all come across at the, the right time, really. We can now build a baby room for later. Um, it'll be more of a toddler room, I guess. Because you can't really do anything with a child right now um, in Sims 4. But that's what we're going to do. We've got enough money to do so. Hopefully Treyarch doesn't get sent home from work early again because that only gave us less than 100 simoleons. I keep like switching between simoleons and dollars, but you understand what I mean. And what else should, could she do today? We've got a lifetime wish as well, which is to achieve four logic skill and finish reading three books. So let's get her to read something. What could she read? She could read literally anything, I guess. The glutton spiel. Go for it. And we kind of need her to give birth soon because that's kind of the point of the episode. So I'm looking forward to seeing what on earth this baby looks like i mean um i have no idea i have no idea what this baby this baby's gonna look like um we're gonna get her to read she needs to go to the toilet again i think they can read on the toilet actually so let's go to use and see what happens can you read on the toilet i had to drink a coffee on the toilet earlier which is a little bit weird can it happen yep it can happen reading on the toilet we all know you all play candy crush on the toilet it's no secret at all um she's also a little bit hungry actually so let's see what's in the fridge got a, a blt let's do it eat a blt why not let's feed this baby and get it out come on give birth it's okay you can do it oh my goodness really are you here again genesis again oh she's quite good friends with um with bristol right now actually that's not too bad but still every day sometimes twice a day she knocks on my door what is wrong with you genesis why do you always do this um she can probably stop reading this right now because she needs to eat get this baby all fed up and ready to come out and i think when the baby is born you just like get a cradle for about two days or actually i think you can age them up like straight away in this sim so we could possibly do that just to see what it looks like but um i guess we need to build a room for it first so we'll be able to see slightly what the baby looks like but apart from that we're not going to know what it looks like properly until next episode which should be quite exciting so she's quite tired which is understandable and we're just going to wait for the guys to get home from work and i will see you in a second maybe genesis would have moved by then she's always peeking through the door like in a creepy way look there she is look under the rim of a Mexican hat. What's she doing? Here we go. Exactly what I predicted. Dan TDM has got a promotion as well. Is that two for him in the same episode? That's awesome. So he's been promoted to a code monkey. He will now make an additional $9 an hour, a total of $47. Um, he has now received um, $506 bonus and a computer hard drive. Pretty cool. So he now works 10 till 7. I think that's a bit better hours than before. But we're on almost 3,000. We will be when Treros gets home. Um, let's have a quick look at his job stats. He needs some fun right now. Um, I will get him to um, go to the toilet and uh, grab a sandwich. 
and then I'll get him to play some games on his laptop thing. Right then, play game. Um, what can he play? Let's play Incredible Sports and quickly check his job description. So he needs to make a plug-in. He's kind of done that already, but not while he had this job and reach level three of programming skill, which he's already done. So he could be getting another promotion pretty soon. And also I found out how you can kind of figure out how long they're gonna be at work without knowing. I know he gets home at nine, but look, there's like a light green circle around, which is kind of like a clock. So when it runs out, it means they'll come home. So that's kind of cool to know as well. Right then, so what shall we do? We kind of need her to go to bed, really. She's reading this book, but you're sleepy. Go to sleep. Did you break the toilet again? Again. He's always breaking this toilet. Replace. Oh, my goodness. Always replacing. I guess he did earn the money to replace it, so that's okay. But still. But still. Right then. Go on. Eat it. Eat it. Eat it. And then... Oh, I want to see what this hard drive was, actually. Let's have a look. We've got... <gasps> I didn't know we got this chair. Oh, unlocked at level two of the secret agent career. Awesome. So we can sell that and replace this and compute a hard drive. I'm not really sure what it does. It might just look, oh my God, it's massive. Why is it so big? Um, okay, that's not the kind of hard drive I'm used to. Um, oh, it can enable emotional aura. That's kind of cool, actually. That's really cool indeed. So we need, why is he embarrassed? Why are you embarrassed? What did you do? Some person can't help but make a fool of themselves in front of their co-workers. What did you do? Oh my goodness, he's embarrassing himself all over the place. Right then, let's eat that and go and play some games. I'm going to enable the emotional aura on that and see which it gives. Hopefully it's focused because that's what he usually needs to be when he's at work. So let's see what happens. He might um, get a little bit less embarrassed now, which will be good. Moving on up. See, he's got a good and a bad kind of little thing. I can't remember what they're called. Moodlet for um for work, which is a little bit unfortunate. And she is still not giving birth. Oh my goodness, how long has she got? It doesn't say, does it? Because she she's definitely going to give birth soon. But when? And um, Dan's just made it to level four of the career of video gaming too. So Trueris is gonna get home from work any second now. Again, again. She's she's here again. She's here again. She's she's just chilling outside. Why? Every time. She's really obsessed with this family right now. It's almost stalker-like. Can we call the police? Yeah, you go away. Get out of here. Come on. Jeez. All right, Charles should be home any second now. And he got 432. He's actually earning a lot of money right now, to be honest. And he's actually feeling pretty fine as well. He just needs to use a toilet. He could probably mop this up as well. And maybe head to bed. I think that should be fine. Um, Dante and GM should be feeling pretty good as well. So let's get them all to sleep. And that should end this day. So I'll be back when the next day begins. And hopefully we have a baby on our hands. Who knows? Who knows? It is time. Guys, she's just come home from work early. She's ready to go. Charles is just like trotting around with a book because um, he just is. So um, he can't really do anything to kind of help this along. But hey. Let's see what happens. Um, she came into work very, very, um, a bit early. I don't think it was too early. 3 p.m. she's usually home. So she rushed home to have a child. What are you, do what are you doing? What are you're supposed to be having a child right now. Um, requires an empty bassinet in order to give birth. Oh, do I need to buy something? Of course. That, that makes sense, I guess. We need uh, a thing for a baby. Oh, God. What, what is it called? Um... Bassinet. Here we go. Uh, this. We need this. So we don't know if it's a boy or a girl yet. So that's a bit annoying. Let's go for green. Let's go for green. That's kind of neutral. And for now, it's going to go um, here. So let's do that for now and see what happens. So can you have the baby now, please? Wait, wait. Have the baby. Here we go. Look, have a baby. I can't believe you have to tell a sim to have a baby. Here we go. Bristol is having a child. This is cute. This is Trorus's child as well, remember, guys. And he's just, like, chilling. He doesn't really, um, he doesn't really seem to be bothered. He's just kind of, like, whatever, whatever. I'm just going to go and read a book. And here we go. The beautiful moment. There's a little elephant in the cot. That's, that's so cute. All right, then, here we go. Here we go. Let's see this beautiful bundle of joy. Okay, so it's a boy. And last name, we want it to be Trorus because, um, unfortunately... Um, it doesn't, when you marry, it doesn't change the names and stuff. So, it has got a randomizer. Um, Russell, Herbert, Austin. Herbert was kind of cool. Herbert. It's Herbert. Herbert Traoris. <laughs> so funny. I was going to call it Craig, but I call it Craig all the time. Wait, wait, wait. Here we go. 
Here we go. It's Herbert Treoris. I don't think he's got his dad's nose, which is perfect, but I'm not sure if they, like, gain their kind of um, features until they're a toddler or not. But there we go. We have a little bundle of joy. That's that's super cute. So I guess um, Trust will just go to work. Oh, fantastic. He didn't say hi to his newborn. But um, here we go. Here's Herbert. That looks really creepy, actually, in the bottom there. So there we go. Here's Herbert, the cute little thing in his cute little, <laughs> his cute little monkey outfit. So thank you so much for watching, guys. If you did enjoy them, please do leave a big fat thumbs up. It will be greatly appreciated. And also, if you happen to be new to the channel, then please do subscribe and join team at TDM today for more Sims, more games, and more Minecraft or of course. So thanks again so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed and also comment down below with what we should do with the new room, what we should spend our money on and stuff like that. So again, thank you for watching and I will see you all next time. Goodbye!